welcome to Small Screen. Before we get into the meat of today's video, we're going to be talking about Alice in Borderlands Season 2, by the way. If you could give us a like, subscribe, and then quack that notification bell, that would be just swell. Right, on to the news. But before that, let's go over what Alice in Borderland is exactly, because this show's seen its popularity go on the rise ever since a certain South Korean show called Squid Game was released on the streaming service. Alice in Borderland is a Japanese Netflix show that's based on a pretty awesome graphic novel of the same name by Haro Aso. This series, which is directed by Shinsu Sako and stars Kento Yamasaki, I hope I pronounced that name correctly, my Japanese is, well, non-existent, takes place in an abandoned Tokyo and the people that are there are forced to compete in some very sadistic games. The lead character is a young chap called Arisu and he's very good at video games, like out of this world good. However, before he found himself in an abandoned Tokyo having to compete in these life-threatening games, literally it's a case of if you lose, you will die, his life was pretty much empty. He was in his bedroom just playing video games and really not doing much of anything. The series ends on a massive cliffhanger and I won't go into that for fear of spoilers. Suffice to say that there's a reason why so many people who've watched the first series are so desperate to know when season 2 of Alice in Borderland will be released. I think the best way to describe this show is Battle Royale meets Ready Player One. Right, now that we've got all that out of the way, took longer than expected, sorry about that. Let's go on to what we've managed to uncover about Season 2's release date. We've been contacted by a source who's very close to the project, again, highlight that very and they had very interesting news to share about Alice in Borderland Season 2's release date. Here it is. Season 2 is happening. Filming began back in July set a tentative December 2021 release date. These things can change. Japan, which is where season 2 is currently filming, has seen cases go up after the Olympics, but working hard to hit that end of 2021 release date. So we already knew that season 2 was happening, Netflix announced that almost immediately after the first season ended, however we didn't know, until now that is, when it would be released. Filming for season 2 started back in July, and these shows tend to take about a year for them to be finished. So season 1 was released back in December 2020, and it seems like they're going to hit that December 2021 release date for season 2. This does actually mean that COVID-19 might have not actually pushed things back as much as we thought it might. However, the source was keen to stress that this could all change if they run into any COVID-19 related problems. But it does seem like the show will finish shooting pretty soon and then it'll be in post-production and that does usually take up to four months. So a 2021 release date does sound like it might be pushing it slightly but that's what they're aiming for and I'm pretty sure that Netflix will want to get this show out as soon as possible given its popularity and the popularity of other shows such as Squid Game. Okay so that's the news. Let us know in the comment what you think about it. We do read all of your comments, by the way. And as usual, if you could like, subscribe, and crack that notification bell, we would be eternally grateful and forever in your debt. This was Edward on Voice. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.